Okay, this is going to be a quick one. I'm just going to have to expose yet another false teacher. Max Lucado. Well, you know, I had my doubts about him a long time ago, but I, you know, didn't really have any proof or anything because I just didn't read his stuff. Uh, anyway, this is a one minute, 34 second video if you want to care to watch it. Well, it's not a, really a video. Somebody put a letter from him to someone. They got a copy of it. It was written from Washington National Cathedral, or maybe it was to them, because Max Lucado is at the top. Written February 11th, 2021. It must have been to Washington National Cathedral, with uh, 3101, I got to blow this up now. All right. 3101 Wisconsin Avenue, Northwest, Washington, D.C. And it goes on, Dear Cathedral Community, It was a high honor to serve as your guest preacher on February 7th, 2021. It has come to my understanding that my presence in the cathedral is a cause of consternation for many of your members. I was invited to the Washington National Cathedral to preach on the topic of the Holy Spirit. My desire was to highlight the power of the Spirit to bring comfort in these chaotic terms at times. However, instead of that sermon, many only heard my words from many years ago. In 2004, I preached a sermon on the topic of same-sex marriage. I now see that in that sermon, I was disrespectful, I was hurtful, I wounded people in ways that were devastating. I should have done better. It grieves me that my words have hurt or been used to hurt the LGBTQ community. I apologize to you and I ask forgiveness in Christ. That's all I'm reading. If you want to read the rest, I guess it goes further and it'll probably move up as the video goes on. Let me see. Yeah, you can read more as if it's a little bit more. That's all. And then, okay, it says, it's just words. You have to notice Max said homosexuals are, quote, children of God, unquote. And yes, they are. All sinners are children of God until they sell their soul to the devil. But the Bible teaches in John 1, 11 through 12, quote, He came to his own and his own did not receive him. But as many as received him, to them he gave the rights to become children of God, to those who believe in his name. Unquote. People that love the Lord are going to read his word, and in it is a direct, uh, many times mentioning, well, first of all, you've got Sodom and Gomorrah, uh, let's see, it was Sodom and Gomorrah, and uh, what was the other one? I can't remember. Anyway, it's, like I said, you can read the rest of it for yourself. It goes on to abortion and gay marriage, and it says Max Zucato must be marked and avoided. He is not an evangelical. See, a lot of us are called evangelicals because we love God, we love Jesus Christ and the Holy Spirit, and we tell people. But others are being called evangelicals when they have been doing that, but have moved up to the point where now they got to make sure they're loved by everybody, so they do things like this. Now, Tell me if I'm wrong, but don't you think Max Lucado, if he was truly following Jesus Christ, 
he would have just said nothing. He would have gone in there on February 7th, preached a message about not fearing, quoted the scriptures on that, taught about the Holy Spirit and how he helps to quench fear, whatever verses he could find on that, if he was there to help people through what's going on now with the V and all. And the disease they claim is going around. Okay, so whatever. I just wanted to mention it. So I'll end it here and say bye for now. I went on longer than I meant to. But you got the gist of it. All right. Bye for now. I'll talk to you later. Probably tomorrow. Okay, bye.